Hello everybody, welcome to another episode of Sunday Showcase, and the game that I'm going to be playing today is Rogue Legacy for PC on Steam, that you can also get on the other versions like on the console, PS Vita, and all that other stuff. It's a roguelike RPG Castlevania, Metroidvania type of game. So let's check it out. Alright, the nice thing is you can play with a controller here. Alright, who do I pick to um, do stuff? Fast hair deal, mass damage, you cannot crit. Hmm. I think I enjoyed those. A huge gold bonus. So, caster. So, basically, you get to choose who your heir is every time you die. So, apparently, they were able to make kids just before they were able to die. So, I'm going to go with the Hokage. Yeah, this this game has the very odd thing of having uh mention of Naruto. Which I find kind of... Yeah. And here's the up or and here's the upgrade screen as I fail to mention make mention of that. Where you can upgrade all your stuff. Every time you die, you bring your money here just to do something to upgrade. Oh, what does the uh fortune teller have? Oh right, the vampire runes. There's a lot of stuff you can do in here. Equip uh certain weapons, equip certain magical runes, just all this other stuff. There's my stat page telling me my strength and all that stuff. What I'm equipping and what benefits I have. Well, let's head on in. Give death 50% of your money. There's a thing you can do where you make a deal with him so that he doesn't take as much money with you. But every time you do this, it randomly generates uh, this map. And I've only beaten a few parts of this. I also played the demo of it too, which uh, is pretty much the same and quite a lot of fun. Yeah, this this takes a while to win, but you'll eventually uh beat it. Oh what? I It would be wise to not get hit. Cause you die rather easily, especially when you have not leveled up. Of course having not played it in a while also is not good. Uh depending on uh, the air, they might have special weapons or abilities. Like disappearing, which cost points. Or magic points. Now I picked this game up because Oh, because I, I always, like, wondered, what if they did ca the Castlevania games with, um... <laughs> what if they had a Castlevania game that always randomized itself each time? And, well, this is pretty much it. Thing is, they don't have... Or, the only thing is, they don't have someone who can whip... Who can whip it. <laughs> certain rooms have traps, and certain rooms have treasures. Want to get as much treasure as we can. I still want to do a Sunday showdown. There was supposed to be one like much, much early on, but... Oh, if you see these floors, there's an invisible part of it. Which leads to typically more treasure. Oh yes, I have the flying boots, that's right. Helpful in certain situations. Oh, and here is what was supposed to be the boss room if I didn't already beat it. And typically, they would lead to another area. Entering the Land of Darkness, which I have not beaten, because it's tough. Each, each like, different location is, like, significantly tougher than, uh, the other ones. So, the reason I haven't beaten this is because, uh, it's just tough. I am about to die, and I don't like that. Ah, stupid jelly. Nobody wants your PB&Js. Oh! Will you pray for assistance? Yes. Hyperon's ring, which I don't remember what it does. Ah, you assholes! Damn it! Death defied. Oh, that—that's a—that's a small ability that rarely happens. Oh, you son of a bitch! And at the end of your death, it shows how many enemies you've killed. Sends you back, and then you pick a new heir. Reroll, because that's a skill I have. Oh, the dragons? Dragons are pretty pathetic, I have to say. And then you got the little traits, which are kind of funny and sometimes annoying. Oh, I'm going to pick this. Most of them have been uh, females in my thing. Yeah, my thing. If you don't know what that thing is. More health is always good. Yes, her trait is that she's colorblind and... Uh, He's always confused. What was the other thing? Spells come out your butt. 
or you're back. You get what I mean. Now, we could always ask this guy to, like, lock down the castle, which, hmm. You know what? Why not? Lock it down so that the map stays the same. But here, the thing with that is, you only get a certain percentage of your money. Or, you only get a certain percentage of money. See, I used to be able to get 18, but now it's lowered. Lowered, uh, it's lowered down. But the map gets to stay the same, so you don't always have to deal with the random factor. Which is a nice design and good trade-off. So, you're not always screwed. These are some of the special boss rooms that you find. Well, not special mini-bosses, I should say. There we go. What did I get? Money, money, money. Dumb picture. I will destroy you and frame you on my... Oh, wait. I was going to say frame on my wall, but I guess it's already framed. Oh, I'm already dead. Come on. Lady Chun-Li, the seventh. Oh, there's nothing else I can spend all this money on, so I might as well put it there. I didn't check to see if he... Farsighted. Anything up close is blurry. Can't get knocked back. Hmm, that's ironic. That's kind of like, uh, me. Except I'm not foresighted, I'm nearsighted. So it's not like me. Ah, missiles. Step. Stab. Oh, hey, it's a special area. Oh, I have to make it count. Ah, I didn't make it count. Ah! Ah, that's tough. Ah, I can never, I can never do it. It seems easy, but it's, but it's not. Oh, geez, you're really inconspicuous. I can't slash downwards, um, except I can only stab downwards, which is kind of annoying. Son of a bitch. Oh, and then you got the thing with the money trapped in uh, the wall, which is never nice. Oh, there's a there's the teleporter. Oh, let's teleport back. As you can see, I've only beaten two bosses, as only two of the uh, symbols have lit have been lit up. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Ah! Uh... And that's all he's ever killed in his life. Sad. Let's go with Sir Gordon the th Third. Uh, the game loads faster when uh, you have the thing locked down, which, depending on how you view it, makes it much easier. Son of a bitch. Hmm, who knew a candle had that much money? Sometimes you'll find rooms, special rooms like that, which is kind of neat. Okay, this is not the picture that will uh, kill you. Good. Because I don't want to die. Yeah, the reason why he's flipping back and forth is because uh, he can't see in three. And this is the fours that I've been, been to, so we're not going there. Except I end up being there anyways. Stupid dog. Oh, oh, it's still there. Hmm, there's a secret somewhere here, but I can't tell. At least it seems like there's supposed to be a secret. Alright, so I'm gonna leave that- Ah! He was waiting for me. What a crafty spike ball. And there's evil Santa Claus in the back. Oh yeah, you'll notice the enemies, like, any, like, the tough area areas are just the same, just more dangerous, because they either shoot more stuff or they just do more stuff. Either way, bad. Ah, uh, I got killed by touching something. Ah, uh, let's, let's at least, like, show off a boss or something. Ah, here's one of those challenge rooms. Ah, son of a bitch. There's a lot of kiss my ass moments in this game. But the rewards are usually runes or something not that amazing. So now I unlock the rune for my uh, chess piece that I can use if I ever choose to use it. Oh, it's this one. Some of them are really, really just... How the hell are you supposed to even be able to do that? 
I probably should head upwards to the attic. That one is the, um, I believe, in terms of difficulty, the third hardest room to go through. I can't believe I dodged that spike without even, like, thinking about it. It's just, yep, stuff's happening, and no, look, I dodged a spike. Ah, oh, no way. And with stuff like that, you just have to, like, uh, equip a different character to go, go, um, deal with it. I only accidentally pressed the teleporter. I didn't actually mean to go anywhere. Alright, we're in the attic. Stupid painting. Oh, I only have five hit points left. Where's the chicken when you need it? I could equip more vampire runes, but that would also take up... Oh, I'm not going in there yet. You son of a bitch! You son of a bitch! Eh, we'll go with Lady Lisa the Third. All right, I have the bounty rune, that's why. All right, I don't have money to unlock that. So many things to discover. Oh yes, and certain uh, character types have certain stats, so the wizard is very weak. And I don't like that. Such an annoying air to play. This is one of those son of a bitch moments. Hmm, how long does this uh, last actually? Oh, right. I was like, geez, how long does these flames last? Oh, only for as long as you have your mana. Ah, the wizards are so weak. And tell me, how does touching the side of a spike hurt you anyways? How wimpy do you have to be for that to happen? No, do not adjust your monitor. Your screen has not been broken and turned into a monochrome screen. This is only because of the game. Oh, these are my favorite. Because that stuff happens all the damn time! You conduct electricity really well. I don't know what that means. As per usual, always play as the ninja, because they're actually just legit legitimately more fun to play. And they're also faster. You said it. What the hell? I did not want to warp. Oh, I can take you on. Gimme. Oh, what did I get? Magic damage increase plus one. Ooh. I don't think I... I don't, you don't see many of those. Oh my god, 34 minutes. I don't know if I can edit all that together. Oh, I said until we get to like... A boss or something. Okay, you're going down, you weird ninja guy. Even though I'm a ninja too, so we're both weird. He still shot me in the face? Oh, I tried to jump! Guard box XL. You never get to ride roller coasters. You're so heavy enemies can't knock you back. You're small and you're heavy. What kind of rock were you under? I keep forgetting to save money for this stuff. It's time to do this thing where... Where we... Where it seems like the room's pretty good, and I don't want to start all over again. Huh! That shield was kind of useless. I mean, he still died anyways. Why did you have to be a son of a bitch? Of all the places to spawn the money, you spawn on the spikes? <sighs> you son of a bitch! I kinda figured it was gonna be like a mimic. That's why I was about to do my little sword attack, but clearly I wasn't fast enough. You son of a bitch. And this is basically the Rus Fu Da hero. Too bad there's no ability to have it, like, manually, automatically, like, recover at some point. Like, slowly regenerate is what I meant. I know, this guy is a son of a bitch. That was another son of a bitch moment. That eyeball is also a son of a bitch. This missile is a son of a bitch. Yes, revenge is mine! 
Although I am about to die. I'm not gonna die to that. Damn it, where's a chicken leg in the... In the, uh... In the wooden furnitures when you need them? Is this place not built by chicken... Built with chicken wings? You know, a chicken wing would be nice. Mana potions are kind of second to all this. Oh yeah, if you leave the screen, uh, their health comes back. Son of a bitch! Okay, fine. Jeez, it's always like, um... Like, oh, will you please unlock the mana tree? It's like, I don't care! You can never use enough before it runs out. That's the annoying thing. Hmm, I did not need to eat that. Oh, now the chicken wing pops up. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch! If you have a health bar, stop putting all these enemies where it's like touching them hurts you. It's really annoying. And almost like unfair. No, wait, not unfair. Bullshit. Alright, let's see what this boss is. I have never seen this boss before. Why am I not surprised? That boss is the exact same boss as the skeleton, only, uh, more asshole and less, uh, fun. Well, now that we found the boss, let's, uh, just kick his ass. I will kick this boss's ass if it's the last thing I have to do. Where's the skip button? I know. Man, if only I had a water spell or something. I've only taken down, like, one quarter of its health. What was I supposed to do? Aside from avoid it. Ah, stupid spike balls. Fuck you. Two heroes down. Much more to go. Yes, I know who you are. Pounce the Leon or something. In which case I don't. But the fact that I remember says a lot. I did that. I didn't know I did that actually. Come on! Oh, too much fireballs, too many fireballs! It's getting too hot in here. Oh, yeah, this is kind of exciting. I'm so close to killing you! There we go. Pyrophobia. Money. Money, 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 money. Ooh, loads of money. MP. Oh, just magic? Oh, screw this. Shh. Worst reward ever. Arr. Honestly, I would have preferred melee attack. Because it's not like, like I said, the magic doesn't regenerate, so you don't. So it's. Just, it's tough to use magic. It's like. Using your money as an attack, eventually you're gonna run out unless you can get more. So that was Rogue Legacy, if I didn't already do it for Sunday Showcase, which I uh, I certainly hope I didn't. But I'm pretty sure I didn't, so I think it'll be okay. But yeah, that's the game. It's a Metroidvania title game. It's pretty fun, if somewhat cheap bullshit, and kind of aggravating. But it's still kind of fun. You'll eventually win, and it does have some satisfying moments. Uh, Quite a bit of satisfying moments, such as finding all the items and such. So if the if this game interests you, then you know go check it out. And uh, but definitely check out the demo just to be sure. So with that said, this is Wizard 100. You're the viewers, and I'm the showcaser. So stay tuned for more for the next video. See ya! Oh yeah, and be sure to check me out on. Um... Never mind. Games finish adequately.